André Lévy-Langue, former president of the Paribas Bank and the uh, legendary mathematician, founder of, uh, and president of the Louis Bachelier Institute. Not everybody knows that Louis Bachelier was a visionary a ma French mathematician, uh, inventing 50 years before. In 1900. 1900. He was the grandfather of financial mathematics uh, applied to the markets uh, in his thesis in 1900. Uh, he was totally unknown until he was rediscovered by Black and Scholes and a few others uh, discovering the formula. Well, the uh, Bachelier, Louis Bachelier Institute is a non-profit private uh, research network which was founded 15 year, 16 years ago by a group of French uh, in companies, uh, mostly financial companies, uh, French fin academic institutions with the support of the French Treasury. Uh, working uh, basically initially in applied mathematics to finance, and then we spread, we broadened our <laughs> scope to cover other subjects, including climate, for the last few years. And, and my topic would li I'd like to be the uh, interaction between finance and geopolitics, what I call the weaponizing of finance. Uh, it's not a new issue. Uh, remember that uh, sanctions and boycotts were used for political means uh, against uh, countries like Angola, Iran, Sudan. But what is new is that uh, since last February, uh, it involves Russia, which is a, a, a significant economy, and that is a major change. So if you look at finance as a weapon, the, the question is, uh, what is the impact of this situation on the huge amounts of investments, which, as uh, Jean-Claude mentioned, will be needed to manage to finance climate change. Because we're talking about very large numbers. So the fact that finance is used as a weapon has imp implications in terms of systemic risk, in terms of the behavior of financial institutions, in terms of the markets. And it is not clear to us, and we're working on that, how can f finance in general su support and uh, make it feasible to uh, accomplish these huge investments without uh, creating systemic risk, without breaking the system, without uh, creating major unmanageable situations. So uh, that is a key issue for, on which we are trying to start a project today with the IFRI, by the way, uh, on this specific subject, again, which is uh, very easy to f express, to formulate, not easy at all to, to, to develop and to make as a research project. I think I will, I am well under the five minutes you asked for Jean-Claude. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well, then we will go back to you to have your judgment on the risks and the materialization of all the risks that we have. Thank you very much, André. <laughs>